गुड मॉर्निंग टू ऑल ऑफ यू माई सेल्फ इरफान खान फ्राम अलकीम साइंस टूटोरियल्स टूडे वी आर गोइंग टू स्टडी अबाउट दी वन ऑफ द इम्पोर्टेंट टॉपिक विच इज स्टडी ऑफ ऑक्सीडेशन रिएक्शन एंड रिडक्शन रिएक्शन एंड फाइनली आफ्टर द कम्पलीशन ऑफ ऑक्सीडेशन एंड रिडक्शन वी विल ऑल्सो गोइंग टू स्टडी अबाउट दी रिडॉक्स रिएक्शन सो लेट्स स्टार्ट वन बाय वन ऑक्सीडेशन रिएक्शन as you know that uh, oxidation reaction as the name suggest of this reaction something will going to happen with oxygen is like that so similarly same thing is going to happen as i told you right now oxidation is nothing but the addition of oxygen in any chemical reaction then such a chemi- chemical reaction is called as oxidation reaction in this reaction you can see here the copper react with oxygen in the presence of heat it will going to produce copper oxide so why we are going to considering this reaction is a oxidation reaction let's understand just observing this reaction i will tell you how can this reaction is considered as a oxidation reaction you can see here copper is going to react with oxygen okay in the presence of heat and finally this oxygen will go, will going to add with this uh, copper and it will f- going to form copper oxide so in this reaction you can see here adding of oxygen is takes place with copper so that's why this reaction is called as oxidation reaction okay the whenever the reaction showing the addition of oxygen with any chemical compound then such a reaction is called as oxidation reaction in this reaction also you can see here oxygen is going to add with copper in the presence of heat and finally it will going to produce twice cuo means copper oxide so this is all about the oxidation reaction let's move on the next reaction next reaction is reduction reaction reduction reaction is totally opposite of oxidation reaction you can see here in this reaction reaction is say like that the reaction in which loss of oxygen and gain of hydrogen is takes place such a reaction is called as reduction reaction okay whenever the reaction is showing the loss of oxygen and add of hydrogen then such a reaction is called as reduction reaction let's understand by observ- observing this chemical reaction you can see here copper oxide having the oxygen and as the reaction definition suggest here the reaction should show the loss of oxygen and gain of hydrogen then that reaction will going to consider as a reduction reaction you can see here this reaction is showing the reduction property you can see here the copper oxide have the one oxygen and after that this oxygen is going to reduce means loss and gain of hydrogen is takes place after the formation of h2 you can see here copper oxide lost its oxygen and remain is copper as a copper and after that this hydrogen is going to add with this oxygen and finally we will going to form water molecule so in this reaction loss of oxygen is takes place and gain of hydrogen is takes place by the formation of water molecule so in this reaction adding of oxygen sorry loss of oxygen is takes place and gain of hydrogen is takes place that's why this reaction is considered as a redox reaction let's move toward the next reaction that reaction is redox reaction redox reaction is totally mixture of oxidation as well as reduction reaction in this reaction you can see here the redox reaction is such a reaction in which reduction as well as oxidation is takes place simultaneously then such a reaction is called as a redox reaction you can see here in this reaction zinc oxide is reacts with carbon metal or carbon after that zinc will become as a normal zinc and carbon become carbon monoxide you can see here zinc will going to reduce because after the loss uh, it will going to lots is oxygen okay and it will going to reduce and carbon will going to accept oxygen from zinc and it will going to oxidize so in this reaction oxidation as well as reduction is takes place simultaneously so that's why this reaction is called as redox reaction thanks for watching 
प्लीज सब्सक्राइब आवर चैनल अलकेम साइंस ट्यूटोरियल फॉर मोर एजुकेशनल वीडियोज़